All right, so I just want to show you really quickly one site you can use when you're um, well, just playing around and trying to think about what colors you want for your color schemes. And that is try color. So you can enter that into the Google search. And hopefully you'll find it. It's try colors. So trycolors.com. And what it gives you is a way to kind of mix color and then save those colors. Uh, for example, let's say I really like red, so I'm going to add red. Okay, so right now this is 100% red. But if I wanted to have that kind of an orange color, I could also add yellow. And that'll give you kind of a, a perfect orange. But maybe if I want a little bit more red, then I choose 80% red. And if I wanted to go back just a little bit, I could add a little bit more yellow and get this kind of orange, okay? And then once I like this color, I can always save it. So I press the save right in the middle, and that is in the palette. So if I'm really wanting to make a warm color scheme, this is probably the best way to do it. Uh, so once again, I could have a perfect red, and then save that to the palette. Um, and then I could, again, you know, as I said, add yellow, add more red, add more red. I could save that to the palette. And then let's say I wanted to have just a bit more yellow again. So I just keep going back. And I save that to the palette. And I have kind of a warm um, color combination, okay? Uh, so if you take a look at the palette that you have, you have these three colors here. And then you also have the hex codes, which you can enter into Pixlr or any other digital art program. So again, I mean, if you're just fooling around, just trying to think about what kind of colors you want, this is one way you can do it.